hi guys, we're back. So, the boom bass tuned, I've slightly changed it from the way it was just before, and I want to show you a couple of things to practice if you're a complete novice, okay? Also, if you're someone that has been practicing the boom bow without guidance, then maybe you would like to uh, check your technique also, okay? So, the first thing is I want to learn to just play without the coin. I don't need that, but I'm just holding it to get used to that, okay? And I want to close the boom bell, and just with this hand, I want to get a full action back and hit. And I hit with the end of the stick around this area, quite low down. And some boom bows got different sounds depending on where you hit them. So you need to start to discover where these different sounds come from, with each boom bow being different also. So I make sure I'm holding it correctly with this hand. I close the boom bow, relax my shoulders and use this action with the fingers and the wrist. Okay? Just hit the boom bow. Don't try and be doing anything flashy. Just closed and hitting the boom bow. Here we go, we've got the, the same thing from the other side. I want you to get this down before we move on, okay? You hold your coin, even though you don't need it, you hold the coin, so you start to become comfortable with that. Make sure you can close the boom bow, and with the stick hitting down low, just try and close the cabasa and get a full action back and then hit freely. You can try with just the wrist, just the fingers and the two together. And you hit you listen to the catchy key. You listen to the sound it makes now. The first thing you hear is the cashew sheet. Okay? Of course, that's not enough for you to start with. You, you're probably not going to do that for a week. So then you start to open and close. And just get used to this. Open and close. Relax. And hit it quite hard. This isn't the rhythm, this is just learning to hit the thing and move. So you open and as you get to here, you hit it. And you don't want this hand to be moving around, okay? You just stand still. And then you go again. And you keep doing that off and on. You leave your boom bow strung up and practice this for a week or two until you get good at this. After, you can learn to do other little tricks, okay? One important thing is that we don't want to open this too much because the sound just is kind of let go, free. You want to you want to have it close so you can control the sound. Also, it doesn't when you sing, you don't want to be competing with the sound of the boom bows. So you need to contain these sounds a little bit. Or, or learn how to control this hand. Okay?
Okay, see you next time, guys. Next time we'll be adding one more thing on, so make sure you practice what you've seen so far. And don't jump the gun. You know, we put the cart behind us and we drag it. Don't want you practicing all sorts of rhythms before you can do that even. Okay, thank you very much. Comments welcome.